She is looking at her mobile phone to check the tram's timetable on her way home after shopping at the transit mall. A tram to her home will be arriving at the happy station in 10 minutes. She is heading to the happy station to ride a bimodal tram. After walking across the crosswalk, passing through the automatic door, and receiving a tram pass. She enters the tram station. The tram station is a future-oriented station where state-of-the-art IT technologies are integrated. With the prior fare payment system to get on and off the tram fast, the unmanned operating management system for the safety and convenience of passengers, and the operation information system installed at each station, the user can check the destination, the arrival time, and the location of the tram. When the tram in the automatic operation mode enters the station, all wheels of the tram are automatically steered inside and stop exactly on the stop line. Since it's a low-floored tram, the passengers don't have to go up the steps when they get on and off, and the fastener for a wheelchair and a baby carriage is available. The interior facilities for the maximization of passengers' mobility, comfortable chairs and windows that create a sense of openness and let in maximum light are installed inside the train. The driver leaves the station only after checking the yellow sign that tells the driver that all the passengers have gotten on and that everything is all right through the monitors and mirrors. All of these situations are managed by the Tram Operations Center. The tram automatically travels while continuously communicating with magnetic markers laid under the dedicated tracks through the sensors installed under the bottom of the tram. The environment-friendly dedicated tracks make the city more beautiful and reduce the urban heat island effect and traffic noise. At the plane intersection, the tram is given the priority signal and makes a right turn along the magnetic markers. The tram's body, made of composite materials, is light and looks elegant. Also. Since it is driven by an electrically propelled hybrid system where the internal combustion engine and the batteries are combined, its noise and exhaust gas are much more reduced than those of the existing bus, and its fuel efficiency is more improved as well. U-shaped breast walls made of transparent or semi-transparent materials around the entrance to the underground tracks helps to circulate light and illuminating facilities are installed inside the walls. Also, the green zone at the top of the underground structures improves the driving safety of the tram and makes the city beautiful. The bimodal tram travels in the automatic operation mode except in emergency situations. The automatic operation mode makes the driver less tired and helps the tram to maintain its on-time performance. The 24 meter long, three unit bimodal tram is coming on the other side of the track. The bimodal tram is a new concept of public transportation where the on-time performance of the subway and the light train is combined with the flexibility of the bus. Its construction costs are much lower than those of the subway or the light train. The elevated bridges for the tram, such as the hybrid steel truss bridge and the hybrid plate girder bridge, built by a new method for fast bridge construction, make the city beautiful. Plate girder bridges are built for a beautiful view of the city. Complicated cross beams are not used and the colors for plate girder bridges well matching with surrounding views are used. The parks built under the bridges provide a more comfortable space for citizens. When the tram enters the transfer center, the signal above the screen door of the station and the signal of the tram are automatically interlocked, and the alarm bell rings letting passengers know the tram is coming. Then the tram stops exactly on the stop line. After passengers in the transfer center check the bus timetable information next to the elevator, they take the elevator down to the first floor and take the bus.